Hi guys, this is Liz of ProjectVandy.com. Good afternoon. Today, I am going to be talking about a hot product right now. It just came out last week. And it's the new AV Advanced Power Paint. So it looks like this. There are four shades. It's only 199 pesos. And what we're doing today is we're just watching everything and trying it on my face so we can see how beautiful it is. Okay? Um, we're going to be discussing that. If you want to try this out, you can get this Lazada at only 199 pesos. <laughs> so check it out. The link is in the description box. At kamusta naman kayo? Um, is there anyone tuning in? Let me know. But um, anyways, I've already done my base. I've already done some concealer. I've also applied some foundation. So I'm gonna proceed na to my kilay. Okay. Um, this is, um, before we do that, these power paints are actually designed for the face, eyes, lips, also in the body. So, marami siyang application. Multi-purpose uh, multi paint siya talaga. So, we're gonna be trying that out um, for those purposes today. So, magkikilay muna ako before we do anything else, okay? Claire, Destiny is here. Julie, ano to? Ba Bebe Obar, Centura. Hi! Mara Garcia, have a nice day. Kamusta naman, guys? How's your week so far? Is it Friday? I feel like I lose track of days na talaga. Um, kasi... You know, you're always staying at home and you're always just kind of working all the time. And so you lose track of the time because of that. Anyways, what I'm using now is the EB Advanced Studio Finish Brow Pen. So it's a brow pen. Yung merong yung parang tinidor. So meron siyang like three sort of like edges. What I'm doing is I'm just running through my brows and following my brow hairs. Para it just looks natural. One of the questions I get a lot about Kilay is... Anong magandang gamitin na product pag manipis ang kilay? And I always, always recommend a brow pen. A brow pen is good because since it's liquid, it's able to create more translucent strokes and create that effect of like, you know, like a hair on your brows, di ba? Nice to catch you again. Hi, Yoli Yamut. Kimi Arsila Asiado. Hello, hello, hello. Um, Julia Bebe Obar Sintura. Kilay na tayo. Ang bilis natin. Like foundation na kasi ako para we can show off the power paints. Do you guys have questions? Anything about beauty, life, whatever, skincare, makeup? Let me know. Para makapagshika tayo. So I'm just doing my other brow now. This is actually a really nice pen because it's very, very fast to use. Although I must say, like, if you use this, you have to be very quick with the application because once it dries, it really, really sets. So there's that. Um, there's that sort of catch with it. Kasi pag natuyo na siya, mahirap na siyang i-blend. Kasi it really sets. So I have here a spoolie just to make sure that everything is nice blended and nothing sort of goes nothing looks thick. Okay. That's what my kilay looks like so far. O diba? Ang ganda na niya. You really don't need to use a lot with this one. Although syempre, the more OC you are, you can really go you can only go to town with it if you want. Those are my dogs, by the way. <laughs> Celia Malagos here. Hello, hello. Sarah uh, Jane Ramos Fisha. Guys, if you have questions, let's have a nice chat. Let's just have... She's me slow. She's me short. So today, what I did this morning, one of the things I did this morning was I set up an Instagram account for my neighborhood. Um, because... I love buying for my neighbors. My neighbors are very enterprising where I live here in Tagu, in Ford. And I love that. They sell so many interesting things, but I hate shopping. I hate shopping in Viber. Nakaka-relate ba kayo? Yung parang when you go to your, your Viber community group, tapos sobrang daming sellers, tapos pa ulit-ulit yung binibenta nila. Like, they keep sharing it, and it looks like a wall. That's like my absolute pet peeve when it comes to buying in Viber. Tapos, some of them are not even in your neighborhood, so you have to order something from Marikina. <laughs> like, something really far from where you are. Just so you can try out the product. Okay, I'm gonna stop with my kilay. Actually, it looks good already. Sabi ni Sha Sarah Jane Felicia, na-try niyo na po ba, Miss Liz? On the go blush. I have tried it. I actually have a video on that one. Sabi ni Alessandra, um, Luis, okay ba gamitin yung Lux Organic sa products? Maganda naman siya. It's very affordable. I haven't personally tried a Lux Organics product. So, I know a lot of people like that. So, you can go ahead if you're into skincare. 
affordable skincare. It's very accessible. Hello po, I miss watching your live. Sabi ni Jel Murilo Quince, thank you. Tanong pa kayo guys, para makapag-chat naman tayo. Okay, I'm gonna stop with the key. <laughs> I'm kind of obsessing. Okay, so that looks really good already. Now we can proceed to our power paints. So the power paints look like this. Alright, and the packaging is actually quite nice. It's um, in a case packaging, so you know, it looks very well displayed in the box. And then you get the EB Advance, there's the ingredients, instructions on how to use. Um, and there are four shades. Now I know, I have to mention this because a lot of people have actually questioned this. Bakit kamukha siya ng Glossier? So I actually have a Glossier, my old Glossier cloud paint here. It looks like this, and the packaging is similar. So, I mean, there's no going around it. It does look quite similar in, in a sense. The Glossier is actually smaller, less of a color band. I'm gonna take it out of the box. There's less of a color band. Of course, the placement of text, but it's very similar, right? Um, for me, like, I really think that Everbelena or EB Advance could have definitely done better with more creative packaging. Like, EB Advance actually has such great formulations now. They're very modern, and I know that they're... Um, product development team is really trying hard with the formulations and the concepts so I feel like they could have definitely done a better design job with this in the sense na mas unique, mas colorful, you know, mas, um, mas bago, of course. Uh, but other than that, of course, that's where the similarities actually end. So I've had this for years. Actually, and dami niya pang laman because in the end, parang I didn't like the Glossier Cloud Paint, uh, the Glossier Cloud Paint so much because Nisha masyadong maganda for me. It's way too transparent. You have to blend like maybe two or three layers to get like a good color payoff. Um, and this is a gel formulation. This one, the EB Advanced one, is actually a mousse formulation. So, sobrang iba siya. They really quite diverge. My dogs are so noisy. <laughs> My dogs are so noisy. <laughs> Sabi ni Len Lopez Estepa, ano po yung kasa, ang gamit nyo kanina pang kila. I actually use an EB Advance. Ito siya. It's called an EB Advance Studio Finish Brow Pen. And the shade that I'm using is, I don't know what this one is. Wood. The shade is wood. Ayan siya. Medyo madumi siya ng konti because I put it on my eyes. But anyways, um, yeah. So anyways, I was saying, this one is a mousse type formulation. And what does mousse mean? It's kind of like a liquid lipstick. Ano na yung mga mousse na liquid lipstick that's like really, really pigmented? Ganun yung formulation niya. I'm actually gonna do like a very quick comparison just to show you the actual difference in the formula. So we have here the Glossier. It looks like this. This is the shade in Dusk, if I'm not mistaken. And it looks very pigmented. But when you blend, it's quite translucent. Then I have here a shade called Amber from EB Advance. I'm just gonna compare para makita niya yung diferensya niya. This is Amber. And, ayan, off the bat, you can see, mas basa yung sa Glossier, mas tuyo, and mas, um, mas mousse, yung mas whipped mousse texture yung EB Advance. So I'm also gonna do a quick swatch for you. So this is the Glossier Cloud Paint. Ayan siya. And it's a really like a gel type sort of um, product, okay? Gel siya. Parang watery gel na medyo may body ng konti. And this one is the EB Advance one. And you can see it's actually super pigmented. There's already full coverage. Whereas the Glossier is quite translucent, you can see. This one is very, very full coverage. So you want to be very careful when it comes to application because it does get quite quite pigmented. So, yun yung difference niya. Glossier is more of a gel tint, like, right? Like a gel formula. While the EB Advanced Power Paint one is more of like a mousse sort of, um, whipped mousse sort of formulation. Para siyang liquid lipstick, actually. So, I'm just gonna erase this from my hand. And, uh, so we can swatch the other products and I can show you what that actually looks like. If you guys have any questions so far, Sabi ni Alessandra Luis, okay po ba gamitin yung, uh, I actually answered that question. Sabi ni Danica Ortiz, um, oh, my God, uh, oh my God, ngayon lang ulit ang kaabot sa live. Hope you're doing great. I'm doing great, thank you. I have a question. Maskne has been a constant problem. I haven't consulted a derma. Would you have any basic tips? Maskne, oh my gosh, kahit na ako, I suffer from that. Um, it's very important to use a very gentle cleanser, low pH exfoliate because it helps with you know like the the dead skin that forms there um, make sure to not use any makeup avoid trying avoid using makeup in that area and also 
you can also use mga spot control gel para mas magdry yung pimples if ever. But sa mask, you can also use like a tissue underneath your mask para matulungan na hindi masyadong magpawis in that area and hindi masyadong magform yung bacteria sa surface ng face with the sweat. That's my answer. Okay, so anyways, ang dami kong sinabi. We're gonna do the swatches. I'm just gonna open all of the product, all of the power paints, the EB power paints. And I'm just going to show you all the shades right now. Okay, so I have here, ito siya. Ito yung product information sheet nila. The EB Advanced Power Paint, paint Multi-Use Color Cream is an all-in-one color product that can be used on the eyes, cheeks, lips, and body. Intensely pigmented but easy to blend, this color cream goes on soft and sets into a smooth matte. Yes, smooth matte nga. Yeah. Smooth, smooth matte. <laughs> wow, Jessica Liu sabi. Hi, Jessica. Kamusta? Nakaabot daw si Salvi Gariel. Good afternoon from the city of Smas, Bacolod. Oh, must be so nice living in the province right now. <laughs> Salvi. Ah, uh, okay. So, I, I just read Salvi's comment. Ayan, guys. So, that's, um, so these are the four shades that we have here. We have um, Chiffon, Scarlet. We also have here a shade called Amber. And finally, we have a shade called Sangria. Okay, so it looks like that. So I'm going to start with Sangria and we're going to swatch every uh, shade that we have here. I'm just going to do a small dot. This is Sangria. Sangria. That's the best way to pronounce that. The thing with these is that you only really need a very, 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 very tiny amount because it's so pigmented. Um, you don't want to waste the product. There's actually a very generous amount here. It's 11 grams of product in a tube. It's quite generous. Mas manay pa sa liquid lipstick actually. And this is how pigmented that gets with like that one drop of product. Okay, we're gonna do a little bit of a blend pa somewhere. Para lang like you can see. You can see what it looks like. Ayan siya. This is Sangria. And it's very, very, very intense. But it's easy to blend naman. So you just have to be careful. And I'll show you a technique on how you can like uh, make sure that you don't make a mistake. Next shade that I have here is Chiffon. So I'm going to swatch Chiffon. And I'm just going to do a very tiny dot as well. Ganyan lang. <laughs> That's Chiffon. Because you don't need more than that. And I'm also going to blend that up. Like so. You can see that it's really, really quite pigmented. I have to do it like this para makita ko yung pag-blend ko. So, this one is chiffon. Actually, chiffon is really pretty. Ang ganda, ha? Like a sort of like a sweet woody pink, I would say. That shade. And then, the next one I have is called amber. You know, like yun niya. And it's washer natin si amber. Uh, tanong ni uh, sabi ni GT Joe um, from Palayan na Nueva Ecija. Hi! Kamusta? Questions guys, kamusta naman ang ating skincare routine, ang makeup routine? Ang makeup pa kayo ng madalas pag lumalabas kayo? Or like me, parang sa eyes lang yung focus. Amber. We're gonna swatch Amber. Looks like that. And I'm just gonna go and go back and forth on that one. Ayan siya. It actually blends out really, really smoothly. You just have to be careful with like the amount you put out because otherwise you might make a mistake. And then finally, I have a shade called Scarlet which I imagine is a scarlet shade. And I'm also gonna put just one tiny dot of that on the, on the hand. Kasi sobrang, sobrang pigmented niya. Watching from Nabotas, na-miss ko manood ng live. Hi, Vicky Zamora, Ignacio. Kamusta? Bongga ng chiffon. Yeah, chiffon is really nice, no? So, okay, scarlet. I-blend natin si scarlet. Oi. In fairness, scarlet actually looks really really nice. This is the kind of red that I always like. Yung parang meron siyang pink undertone. Because it always brightens the skin tone so, so well. So, just to summarize, the first shade that we have here is Sangria. Sangria. The second one is Chiffon. Sangria is more of like a sienna, like a burnt, um, reddish sienna shade. Then we have Chiffon here, the second shade, which is more of like a woodsy, pink, um, sweet pink type of shade. And then next here, this is called, um, ap Amber. This one is amber. And this one is more of like an amber tone. So, ayan siya. More of like orangey, golden sort of like a shade. And then finally, scarlet is like a pinkish red tone. Now, you know what, guys? I'm gonna be honest. Like, I really want... <laughs> I mean, of course, maganda yung lahat ng shades. They're all very wearable. Pero I like... I want to wear amber on my lips. And then we're gonna do the other shades on my eyes, ba? Because I've been doing a lot of monochromatic looks. So, para maiba naman. 
<laughs> um, gusto ko ng Sangria and Chiffon, Jude Omega. Maganda nga, maganda yung shade. Sabi ni Jessica Liu, I do the upper part lang. Skincare more on masks. Japan brand, nabili ko last <laughs> January. Yeah, sa masks, no? Ako rin, like sa gabi, like I usually mask. I use like a, um, a device to mask para maganda yung ano. Sabi ni uh, Len Lopez Estepo, I love the color of the chiffon lipstick. Can you use it on your lips, please? Sige nga, papakita ko yung chiffon para ma-appreciate ma nyo yung look niya. But I'm gonna use sangria later. Sabi ni um, Irene Andoy Molina, Miss Liz, na-miss ka po namin ng anak ko, ang lala na lalaki naman po, pero aliw na aliw po sa inyo. Charles Molina po, pa-shoutout. Hi, Charles Molina. Thanks for watching. I'm glad na aaliw ka. <laughs> and I'm glad that you're enjoying this. So, thank you. And thank you to your mom, Irene. Okay, chiffon. Guys, ito yung gusto natin. So, when you're applying a really, really pigmented product like this, I always recommend magsimula kayo from your hand. Okay, just put a tiny amount just the exact amount you need on your hand and then from there you can go and apply it with your fingers or if you have a lip brush or an eye brush it's up to you what you want to use but i'm just going to use my fingers for this because it's a type of product that's really really good to apply with the fingers so let's do chiffon so chiffon on the lips so i'm gonna do it like this so i'm gonna sort of like blend it out for a bit and i'm gonna go straight and you can see it's very pigmented Ayan siya. You can use it like this. So more of like a more of like a sweet sort of like a matte color like that. If you have lip balm, if you have dry lips, you can put lip balm first and then you can blend it para mas maganda yung blend niya. But this is what it looks like when it's just like a sort of like a soft application. I'm going to show you what it looks like when you really amp it up like full coverage. Actually the full coverage it's just gonna be more opaque. Pero same color pa rin naman. Hindi siya masyadong magbabago. So I'm gonna go get another layer. And actually from here, it's like you're applying a full-on liquid lipstick already. Oh my gosh, that's really... The texture. That reminds me of. Ang ganda, di ba? Ano? <laughs> Um, sabi ni Vamich Sukab, Hello Miss Liz, lagi kasi kay, uh, kayo naka-face mac, ano yun, nice color for everyday eyeshadow. Ito, maganda to pang eyeshadow kasi mabilis lang gamitin. Sabi ni Lala Torres, are you on Netflix? What's your reco to watch? Oh my god, Netflix. Um, I've actually been watching a lot of Amazon, uh, Amazon Prime <laughs> TV. Uh, I've been watching more of mga sitcoms like Office, Caught in Cleveland is pretty good, but it's not on Netflix. I just started on Teenage Bounty Hunters because it's so interesting. So, yun yung pinapanood ko ngayon. <laughs> um, ayun. Anyway, so that's what the chiffon looks like. So, for my eyes, I'm actually gonna do a different um, color for the eyes. Just, just so you can see the difference. I'm gonna go for um, amber for my eyes. So, amber is the shade that's more on like an orangey type of shade. And again, one drop lang kailangan natin. You don't really need a lot. And I'm just gonna use my fingers again with that. I'm just gonna wipe my fingers. And I'm gonna go straight on the eyes with this one. As you can see, very pigmented. So you can really get as soft as you want or as intense as you want with these. And I love it because it's so easy to work with. As you can see, konting chok-chok lang, okay na siya agad. You don't even need a brush with it. And what I do is, I like to blend the edges of that of that initial initial um, layer. And you get a lot like a smoother result with that. And what's nice about this is that it sets. Like, to, I wouldn't say to me, guys, but it's like the liquid lipstick that you use where it sets um, on the skin. So, hindi siya madaling gumalaw. Kahit nang hindi ka na mag-eyeshadow primer, maganda yung, ay, ang dami. Maganda yung register ng color. So, we're gonna do the same on the other side. Like so. And you can see that it's like konting-konting application lang. Ang ganda na niya. And again, you can go really, really intense. As intense or as soft as you want. It's really up to you. Oh, diba? Look at that. So nice, diba? 
nakabright siya ng eyes. So, again, may nagtanong sa akin kanina, paano kung nakamask ka and um, hindi naman kita yung lipstick, hindi naman kita, ito ang eye makeup <laughs> na maganda. And if you want, you can apply like a little bit of shimmer in the center, which I'm actually gonna do just to show you what that looks like. And it can get really, really, and it, you can create a really nice dimensional look with that. So, for the shimmer, I think I'm gonna go with this one. This is the EB Advanced Face Trio, and they have a highlighter here. And I'm just gonna use in the center just to kind of create that halo effect on the eyes. And again, we're just using our fingers, really. We don't really need a brush. Although you can use a brush if you're more comfortable with that. Also. Ayan siya, oh. Ang ganda, di ba? I always do this. It's just a nicer effect. And actually, you can do like an entire eyeshadow look if you feel like it. And you can use the power paint as an eyeshadow primer. Maganda siya for just holding down your pigments. Ang pretty, di ba? <laughs> um, I miss your live vids. Hi, Cartain Dal. Mask proof. It's actually quite nice because, as I said, it sets completely. Once it sets, it... It will smudge a little bit, pero very little. Kasi tumitigas siya, nagsaset siya completely sa skin. Okay, so anyways, um, that's for the eyes. Now, I have something new here. I'm not gonna show you, I'm not gonna talk about this brand yet. Because I'm still reviewing it. And I'm gonna do, ah, nahulog. I'm gonna do another uh, video for this one. But I just wanna show you, because it's really so amazing. I was testing this yesterday. Nasaan yung aking, ah? Uh, My, my lash curler is missing. <laughs> and you know, I just organize everything. And I think I just misplaced it again. Which is really, really annoying. I, never mind. I'm just gonna use this other lash curler. Um, sabi ni, um, shout out sa mga break time employees ng Mercury Drug Blumentritt. Sabi ni Merli de la Cruz. Hi, mga employee ng Mercury Drug Blumentritt. Kamusta naman? Thank you for doing what you do. Ano yan? I have to clean this for a bit. Thank you for doing what you do. And I know it's very hard, especially now. So, I hope you got have a good break time. And I hope you enjoy watching while you're here. Okay, this is a Shuemura lash curler, but it's a lash curler for the inner lashes. It's not really meant to be used like this. But I'm kind of desperate, so just gonna do that. And try to get a curl. This is awkward. <laughs> Nasa yung lash curler ko. Ano ba naman yun? Anyways. Um, have you tried the... Uh, nanto? Patapos na. Sabi ni Chai. Hindi pa... I'm gonna try another shade on my lips actually. Um, sabi ni Salvi Gariel. What products can you recommend to use po? Now that we're wearing a face mask. Drugstore products po. If possible. Um, of course. Ito yung... Kinitry ko ngayon. EB Advance is really good. Anyways. I'm just gonna put this eyeliner. And then we're gonna put lashes on. Okay. I'm gonna do another video on this, but I just wanna show you because I'm so fascinated by this. And I think it's so cool. But yeah. I'm just gonna do a quick line. Ayan. So simply lang. Tapos I have here some lashes that I'm just gonna pop on top of the eyeliner. Para lang maiba ng konde, no? So I'm just gonna go ahead and just put that right on top of the eyeliner. And may lashes na ako. Bongga, ba? Secret mo na kung ano to. So ko lang pahita sa inyo. Ayan. Okay, and then we're gonna do the other eye. Same technique. We're just gonna do the eyeliner. And we are gonna apply the lashes after doing the line. Right. 
when I do eyeliner like this, I usually start with just an outline first and then I fill it in by sort of stamping it. It's so awkward yung line na to, pero okay lang. Maganda pa rin tayo, di ba? Okay? And then I'm gonna put the lashes on top. Um, <laughs> and, bil and to? Questions pa, guys, about anything that you've seen so far. Um, so, as I said, I just did a very, very quick eye look. And then I'm just gonna put the, eye, the lashes right on top here. Like so. And this will create a really nice effect. Ayan. Perfect. Ang fresh tingnan talaga pag nakalashes, no? Anyways, back to our power paint. So, for the power paint, I'm gonna use naman, I used amber on my on my eyelids, as you saw. It was super nice. For my cheeks, I'm actually gonna go with the Sangria shade para ma-appreciate natin lahat ng kulay, di ba? So, Sangria looks like this, and I'm just gonna apply again. If you're applying uh, pigmented products like this one, you have to be careful and only apply from a palette or the back of your hand para makontrol nyo kung saan nang gagaling ang ating color, okay? Sabi ni Cartain Dali, live painting po, please, then we'll post it on IG and tag you. <laughs> it would be nice to do a live painting one of these days. Okay, so, again, when you're applying a shade, pigmented shade like this, you want to start with only the smallest amount. And you want to diffuse that on your hand first, so you can kind of have, a con have some control over how much color gets on your on your on your skin because sometimes when you're applying pigmented products like this diba, it's very easy to make a mistake and kind of over apply so you want to be careful there and just go like this ah, diba? and then you can add more and more if you need more but I think for our purposes this actually looks pretty good already diba? sobrang nice sobrang diffuse nung color and it just looks so so pretty I think Sangria is probably... Chiffon is nice, but Sangria is definitely more pigmented. Oops. That Sangria is more of like a redder, intense version of Chiffon, which I always like. And you can always diffuse it naman according to what you want eh. Oh, di ba? Ang nice. Fresh lang. So, again, the uh, the color I use on my lips is chiffon, the power paint is chiffon. For the eyes, it's amber. And then for the cheeks, it's um, sangria. Sangria. Sa yung sangria. Ito yung sangria. So, para makita nyo lahat ng colors. But just to show you again, I want to wear uh, scarlet because it really speaks to me. I love the intensity of that red shade. And I feel like it's gonna look pa rin nice with this color story. So, I'm just gonna remove chiffon. This lipstick, ay nagtanong sa akin kanina, is this, um, is this mask proof? And my answer is, ito siya, completely dry. And I'm gonna put, um, this is water, right? And I'm just gonna spray that with water. Ugh, I got that on my face. And as you can see, hindi nagraran yung color. And even though I'm doing this, hindi siya nabubura. Ayan. Of course, if you rub super, super, like, intensely, ayan. I'm rubbing at full force. Oh, actually, it's still there. <laughs> so, it's definitely mask-proof. Especially if you apply only a thin layer and even a thick layer. Once it's completely set, kahit na magkatubig or pawis-pawisan ka or whatever, anong, anong ginawa mo sa araw, pumila ka sa grocery buong araw, it's not gonna fall apart on you. So, definitely, this is a mask-proof formulation, which, again, is very relevant for our time. So, that's nice, right? What do you guys think of that? <laughs> Sabi ni Kat Magsino, Chiffon and Sangria look so nice. EB is really st stepping up their makeup game. Totoo. Ang galing ang fresh po. Thank you, Vicky Ignacio. Um, Cartain Dali, I think that could be a do for Glossier. Actually, in the beginning of this video, I did a comparison with Glossier. Iba siya. Glossier is a gel. This one is a mousse formula. So, iba talaga siya in terms of formulation. Similar in packaging, but very, very different with formulation. Anyways, I'm gonna erase na ma, my uh, lipstick. I use lip balm on top just to remove it. Sorry about my dogs, guys. My dogs are... 
crazy <laughs> outside right now. I actually found a helper at home, which is amazing. Of course, I didn't have a helper for like four months, five months actually. And finally, I found one who lives in my neighborhood. So now she's walking the dogs. <laughs> That's why the dogs are crazy because they're like, ah, I'm going out. I always go. Super excited when they go out. Okay, so that's, uh, I just removed the collar and it looks like that. As you can see, it's stained. Siya. Mahirap tanggalin niya, actually. And so we're gonna go with Scarlet. Okay, I'm excited. <laughs> Hello, Dao. Hello, Miss Liz. Hi, Krishy. Pasagwe Amber. Kamusta? Questions pa, guys. You guys have any questions about the EB Advanced Power Paints? Again, you can purchase them at Lazada. $1.99 lang. Very affordable. Okay, now, on to Sangria. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna get an amount on my hand, like a drop. Ayan, single drop lang kailangan natin. Medyo it gets messy at the at the tip, but you know what? It looks, you can just wipe that. It's very easy. And just make sure na every time you use it, you wipe it. Okay, and then I'm just gonna use my fingers. And this is a very, very red <laughs> sort of shade. So we're gonna apply that on the lips. And I'm gonna start with a gradient look and see where, where that takes us. Ayan. Oh, that looks so nice. Oh, diba? This is a single layer. Hindi siya like... Mu sobrang mousse talaga yung texture niya. And it's very, very easy to work with as you can see. Ayan. Oh my God, I love this color on my lips. I always like, again, like I said earlier, I always love... Um, reds like this because reds like this yung me medyo pink yung undertone always brighten Filipina skin tone yung medyo yellowish um, the yellowish skin tones we have this always works to brighten that area just always nice ayan siya ang ganda ba? <laughs> what's the shade po under your pinky which one ah this one this is uh, sangria chiffon amber and scarlet which I'm wearing on my lips um, I placed my order two days ago. 188 siya, sabi ni Yanni Lee. Oh, oh diba? 188 pa pala. So, they have their own promo price pa. That's good. <laughs> um, the IG Live Balm is a balm in removing waterproof lipsticks. Ito, oh. Waterproof lipsticks, walang takas dyan. So, again, as I showed you kanina, guys, this is a water-resistant, a highly, highly water-resistant formula. So, if you're wearing a mask and you just have a lipstick on, you want to put some blush and you don't want that to come off completely, then this is a good formulation for you. Okay, guys. <laughs> it pops. Sabi ni Cartain, Dali, yes, no? Ang ganda, oh. Scarlet's such a nice color. <laughs> Tanong ni Elaine Verano Serranilla, which among Sangria and Chiffon is better for Morena in everyday use? I would say, um, for, if you're a Morena, I would actually go more for Sangria because it's a more, uh, slightly deeper version of Chiffon. Ito si Sangria, ito si um, Chiffon. Mas deep siya ng konti, mas, ma mas medyo brown siya ng konti. So, it's definitely gonna work for those um, Morena Beauty. So, if that's what you're looking for, that's great. Um, sabi ni uh, Lerma Jonota, kaya lang water ang ginamit mo. How about pag perspiration wherein, wherein it is acidic, will the effect be the same? pH of water 7, while perspiration is below 6 kasi acidic. Lama, uh, Lerma, Jonota, that's actually a really good question. Will it dissolve when you sweat a lot? You know what? That's a really valid point. It's a great point because, you know, when you're acidic, definitely it will affect your cosmetics. Walang makeup na um, kakapit with like intense perspiration for a long time. Siguro for the first 30 minutes or one hour, it's gonna look fine. But like after <laughs> maybe one past one hour of perspiring nonstop, yes, it's not gonna look the prettiest. So my advice actually is if you're wearing makeup, you can like um, put the piece of tissue. So you have your face mask, whatever face mask you use, and you can just put this. You can just fold it like prettily if you want. And you can just put it like this and put it under your face mask so that when you sweat, the tissue absorbs the sweat and then your makeup kind of stays put 
um, hindi siya masyadong nag-rub. Kasi yung rubbing din yung problema. It's not just the pH level of the skin and the sweat. It's also, you know, the rubbing effect of the mask. So, if you do, um, if your concern is that, then you can just apply it maybe after um, you uh, go wherever you're going. Or you can also put tissue. That's my advice. Okay? <laughs> So yeah, guys, that is it. Just to summarize, this is the new EB Advanced Power Paint. There are four shades available, $1.99, available in Lazada, and EB Advanced stores nationwide as well. Meron sa shop ito, I believe. And it looks like this. Now, the shades that I use on my eyes are amber. This is amber. Ito yon. On my cheeks, I use sangria. This one. Kanina, suot ko yung chiffon sa lips ko, but I changed it to scarlet, and it's this one. And I really love it. O, di ba? Sobrang intense, sobrang nice. So, that is it for my live video for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching my EB Advanced video. If you enjoyed it, please do give us a follow at Project Panty.com on Instagram. Also, read ProjectPanty.com. I'm gonna put in, like, a full review of these ones soon. And, yeah, thank you so, so much for watching. And thank you for a fun afternoon. Um, let me know uh, if you have any questions. You can DM me. And, yeah, have a fantastic weekend. Alright, I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye!